Jammed. You again? <laughs> yes, me. Lance Corporal Samuel Taylor, U.S. Marine Corps. Well, thank you, Uncle Sam. Edward Baranoff, ex-captain. Glad to meet you, Ed. 
How'd you end up in this mess? <sighs> this is one of my ports. <sighs> Usually the traps downstairs were enough. The Fuglies here know well enough to stay away. <sighs> Let's go before some more arrive. <sighs> Stupid beasts. You kill a bunch, but they just keep coming. Help me move this, Sam. You got it? Come on! <sighs> oh, we did it. Ugh, I hurt all over. Which is a good sign. Means I'm alive. So, where was I? Ah, yes. Then the bandits from the cinema decide to throw a party for the local gang bosses. And think far enough ahead to chase a pack of fuglies away from the ruins next door for extra security. So the poor mutants arrived here and got sandwiched between the bandits and the other parks in the vicinity. The only way open for them was up. I could beat them, but that gem... You're welcome. I've been looking for you. Did you talk to Tom? Yeah. He suggests a deal. Yes, he's fond of those. Come, son. Let's not waste time here. Damn. <laughs> I hate being old. We're almost there. All right, my own personal savior, let's set sail. Come aboard. We have a long way to go. Tell me, Ed, what happened here during the war? Doesn't look like the city took any direct hits. So why is it in such a state? Yeah, there were no direct hits. The warheads fell into the sea, all in a neat little line. My sub didn't even shoot. All the targets were destroyed without our help. We called the base for orders, but there was no reply. The base was hit naturally, so we sailed here. That's where the HQ was. When we reached the city, we couldn't recognize it. It was even worse back then, of course. Just the smell alone. There were very few survivors, and frankly, we were surprised to find any. We picked them up from the roofs, organized somehow, and ended up settling in the dock. The place ended up pretty cozy. At least we had no problem with electricity, with the reactors running. And by the time they ran out of fuel, we had a floating power station ready. All this luxury ended up generating rumors. So the bandits started coming by to check us out. Finally, one day Tom arrives, with an offer of uniting our forces and setting up an effective defense perimeter. Mm, that bastard. Sniper, get down! Damn it! Did he get you? I'm fine.